All right, so we're gonna try this whole fried watermelon popcorn thing. As you can see, I extracted the popcorn. It, that fat in there is disgusting. It's so fatty and sticky. Anyways, I'm gonna do, I don't have a walk and I'm not outdoors. So we're gonna try it a safe way. We're gonna go a little bit at a time to get the flavor. Okay, we got the fried watermelon part going. Put on full heat to get the full extraction of flavor. I'll wipe up my board while we're waiting. I'll throw this away. You see all that fat in there. It's turning red. He threw the whole rind in there and somehow the the whole center was hollow after he was finished. So I'm assuming it disintegrated, but this doesn't look like it's disintegrating. There's the watermelon. It's a 22 pound watermelon. So let's see. I think at this point he just dumped it in. But I have to figure out how I want to do this to actually... I guess I can just fish out the popcorn. Let's try to get more flavor first. Smells like oil and popcorn. Not oil and popcorn. Oil and watermelon. Not so... doesn't smell like watermelon. It smells like fried. Eh. It's weird. <laughs> Okay, let's go in. We'll see if it starts popping all over the place. I'm assuming popcorn floats. So, popcorn sank to the bottom. See how hot this is. Oh, it's above boiling for water, so it is frying. Let's see the popping. Full heat. No action yet. I'm assuming it'll start soon. Any time now. So I just do more wiping while I wait. since it popped a lot when I put it in initially. Come on, 
Give me one. I just want one, one kernel. My ratio of oil to watermelon too, as compared to his, I put more watermelon, so I should get more flavor. You can see a lot of the color is leached out of the, the watermelon already. Any time now. Well, it's going to keep getting hotter as the moisture and the watermelon evaporates. So maybe we'll see some, we'll see some action eventually. get a, a cover just in case this gets dangerous. Well, we'll see the action. If it starts to pop, I'll put the, put the cover over it. Actually, I have more popcorn over here. Throw that in. I've been eating a lot of popcorn recently, <laughs> so I save all the unpopped kernels. And then I happen to see the watermelon popcorn video pop up. Come on, just give me one. Maybe if we get to 300 or 350, we'll actually see some action because that's the 325 is probably what you see a normal fryer run at. Uh, 
All right, just to speed up the, instead of cooling it down with all this watermelon, I'm gonna take the watermelon out. To let the oil get hotter. Uh. There's the watermelon. Oh, oh, is did that pop or was that there the whole time? There's another one. Oh, it's, it's not red though. I guess we'll put the uh, watermelon back in just for uh, authenticity. So we know that it does want to pop. It just has to get hot enough. Oh, there's another pop. I'm not going to pull it out. All this watermelon sugar on the edge of the pan. Come on, pop. I just heard one pop. Oh, is that it? There's more popping. Oh, yep, it's popping. Okay, it's popping. Okay, somebody in the comments tell everyone else. Skip to 15 minutes if you want to see the popping. So it doesn't look like it's going to explode. I'm going to put my safety away. Actually, I'll, I'll use it to collect the popcorn. Yeah, 
get all this watermelon flavor back in. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here's the action. I put a whole bag and then some in there. There's going to be some oily ass popcorn. Look at the watermelon, it's fried, fried to, it's like a french fry already at this point. I guess I'll, I'll eat, I'll eat some of that for the video too. You can watch me eat super fried watermelon. Okay, I think I'm going to start fishing it out and cut the heat. some uh, fried watermelon for you. All right, that's the pot, that's the popcorn, let's taste it. I do not look forward to this. Holy shit, it's so floppy. <laughs> it's like candied already. Let's find the nice piece of popcorn. Okay, that should be good. So we have this guy that, huh, it's actually, it's like, this one's actually crispy. That one's really hot. Let's cut it open. There we go, fried watermelon. That's really hot. So I'm just gonna taste the popcorn for now. It tastes like really bad popcorn. It's, it's like, it's just bland popcorn, basically. It's not burnt or anything, it's just bland. Could it be worse? Yeah. <laughs> it tastes like what it looks like, a caramelized like yam or something. You wouldn't be able to tell that it was watermelon. Anyways, that's it. Like and subscribe.